Alright guys, what's up? Um, today I'm going to show you all the, um, uh, I'm going to actually review an app. It's called SpeedFan. Let me actually go to somewhere right here. Um, let's go to Magnifier. I love Magnifier. It's so cool. Magnifier. Okay, minimize that. Okay, now I'm going to drag my Magnifier up a little bit. I'm going to review this app here. It's called SpeedFan. Now, with this app, it's pretty cool. So, here we go. Now, I have SpeedFan open. As you can see, there's Help, or Readme, and there's SpeedFan. I'm going to go ahead and click on SpeedFan. I'm going to actually exit out of the magnifier. Now, exit. Because you pretty much can see the app. Um, this is a very good app to tell your... Well, sometimes it's screwy, but... Um, you can also has a minimize icon down here, as you can see. Um, it, what the SpeedFan does is it's a type of app that <coughs> has it's right now in the process of being extremely used because of the video recorder on the screen. But what this app is for is it helps the computer tell you what temperature of everything is. So I think that tip two is the um, temperature of the processor. It keeps changing from negative Celsius to pot to regular to really hot for some reason. I don't get it, but a hard drive it doesn't seem to temperature to, um, get the temperature. The core of the processor is 41 degrees Celsius. Now, what I use to convert this is I'll show you this top again. So I use something called temp converter or CPU and GPU. So let's I'll enter like first you gotta fix this. Now, Google search temperature measure converter. Download and you will find this. It's say 32 degrees Celsius is now 89.6 degrees Fahrenheit. That's pretty cool. But let's do my processor temperature right now. Okay, let's enter 40. Convert. That's about 104. 39 actually. We'll go back and do 39. You know what? I, I like doing this because, well, now my computer temperature is 102. The processor core, and I've only been up for a couple hours. So, well, I guess that's it, guys. Peace.